Hello guys, welcome back to Concrete Elbow. Dennis won 6-0 over John at King of the Table 6, but was it a pure domination? Let's break it down a bit. So on every single round, John could not move Dennis off center. Dennis' static center table strength was just too much for John to be able to do anything to it. But at the same time, Dennis also couldn't pin John with a single search on every single round too. Three of the pins actually consisted of John giving up. So yeah, it's clear that Dennis's weakness at his current form is his finishing power. This is actually not a big surprise really. Based on the videos that was uploaded on True Power's channel, it seems that Dennis only started training his offense just a few weeks prior to his match with John. Before that, the only training videos that existed were only Dennis training his endurance by holding his training partners. This is the reason why Dennis' static center table strength is absolutely perfect, but his finishing power was lacking. I think this is the same case with Devin. When Devin trains, he doesn't attack. He only holds. But the difference with Dennis, when Devin is in an actual match, he also only holds his opponent until they bleed. Literally, until they couldn't do anything anymore. And then after that, Devin has two choices. Let his opponent pin themselves, or try flash pinning his opponent. Only if he's 100% sure that they're absolutely tired. Devin fights the same exact way as how he trains. But in Dennis's case, he trains the same way like Devin does, but on his match with John, specifically in round 1, Dennis tried holding John off center for a few seconds, but then he tried to pin John right after, and of course he couldn't finish him off. Dennis didn't actually pin John in round 1, John pinned himself. Devin and Dennis will face each other later this year. They said it's probably gonna be on October, but this is not confirmed yet. It's clear that Dennis has a really good endurance. He didn't even break a sweat at King of the Table 6, but we're talking about Devin here. I don't think there's a single person in this world that can top Devin's endurance off. I think if Dennis wants to win this match, he needs to up his strength as much as he can. In a safe way, of course. I don't think Dennis needs to train his center table strength anymore. It's already really, really good. Because if you're going to arm wrestle Devin, you don't train your endurance. You train your strength, your power. The only way to beat Devin is to be so much stronger than him that his endurance don't matter anymore. It's still about 7 months until October, and I'm sure Dennis already know about his weakness from the John match. I hope he can be even more powerful when he faces Devin.